mark the water level. Add some salt to the water. Stir it thoroughly with a spoon. Observe the changes. Once again, add some more salt to the water and stir it. Now, observe the changes. Here, we find the changes in the levels of water. Open a water tap. Allow the water to reach the ground. Now try to break the stream of water with finger. Release the finger after few minutes. Observe the changes. Here, we observe that the water flows with more velocity than its normal velocity for few seconds after the finger is released. Later on, the water reaches its normal velocity. Similarly, we observe that the forces of attraction between particles or the maximum in solids, intermediate in liquids, and minimum in gases. Finally, we learn that both solid and liquid particles have some space between them. The solid particles enter in the space between the liquid particles when solids dissolve in liquids. We also learn that the particles of the matter have forces acting between them that keeps the particles together. It is also clear that this force is not equally strong in all the forms of matter. The force between particles of matter is called as cohesive force.